Frankie Beverly, the legendary singer, songwriter, and producer, left an indelible mark on the music world. Born Howard Beverly in Philadelphia in 1946, he formed the iconic soul and funk band Maze in 1970. With his distinctive baritone voice and captivating stage presence, Beverly became the heart and soul of Maze, guiding them to immense success. Frankie Beverly, the legendary lead singer of Maze, amassed a net worth estimated to be around $4 million at the time of his passing in September 2024. His decades-long career in music, characterized by iconic hits like Before I Let Go and Joy and Pain, solidified his status as a musical icon and contributed significantly to his financial success. Beverly's talent, combined with Maze's enduring popularity, ensured a steady income stream throughout his career. Maze's music, characterized by its infectious grooves and soulful melodies, resonated with audiences worldwide. Their nine gold albums and dedicated following cemented their status as genre pioneers. Beverly's songwriting prowess, coupled with his production skills, ensured that Maze's sound remained fresh and innovative. Beyond his musical talents, Beverly was known for his signature style. His all-white attire, featuring tailored slacks, a long-sleeved shirt, and a baseball cap, became a trademark of his performances. This iconic look inspired fans to dress in white at Maze concerts, creating a unique and unifying atmosphere. Beverly's legacy extends beyond his music. His son, Anthony, a talented drummer, has toured with Maze, carrying on the family tradition. In 2009, Anthony and his former wife, Heather Beverly, organized a tribute album titled Silky Soul Music, an all-star tribute to Maze featuring Frankie Beverly. This project, released under Brandt Era, celebrated Beverly's contributions and featured performances from renowned artists like Mary J. Blige, Babyface, and Mint Condition. Frankie Beverly's music continues to inspire and entertain. His timeless melodies, soulful voice, and charismatic stage presence have made him a beloved figure in the music industry. His legacy will live on through his music and the countless fans who have been touched by his artistry. A legacy honored, Frankie Beverly's accolades. Frankie Beverly's exceptional contributions to music were celebrated in 2024 with a series of prestigious awards. His profound influence on generations of fans earned him the living legend honor at the Urban One Honors. This award recognized his extraordinary talent and enduring legacy. Earlier that year, Beverly received the Phoenix Award, the highest honor bestowed by the city of Atlanta. Mayor Andre Dickens presented this award during Beverly's final tour, acknowledging his significant impact on the city's cultural landscape. Moreover, the NAACP Image Awards honored Beverly with the Lifetime Achievement Award. This prestigious accolade celebrated his enduring influence on R&B and soul music, solidifying his status as a musical icon. Beverly's live performances, particularly at events like the Essence Festival of Culture, were renowned for their electrifying energy and ability to unite audiences. His captivating stage presence and soulful voice left a lasting impression on all who witnessed his performances. Frankie Beverly, a private life behind the spotlight, Frankie Beverly was renowned for his enigmatic persona, preferring to keep his personal life private. Despite his public success, he maintained a grounded approach to his relationships. Beverly was in a long-term relationship with Pam Moore, a news anchor at Cron 4 in San Francisco. The couple met in 1986 and shared a deep connection that endured for many years. While they never married, their partnership was a testament to their enduring love and commitment. From a previous relationship, Beverly had a son named Anthony Beverly. Following in his father's footsteps, Anthony has become a talented musician, often performing with Maze and contributing to the band's enduring legacy. Early life and career. Frankie Beverly, from local gospel to global icon. Frankie Beverly's musical journey began in the heart of Philadelphia, where he first discovered his passion for singing. As a schoolboy, he joined the local church choir, immersing himself in the soulful world of gospel music. Growing up in East Germantown, Beverly honed his vocal abilities and developed a deep appreciation for the musical traditions of his community. In his teenage years, Beverly formed the Blenders, 
a cappella doo-wop group inspired by the harmonies of the Dells, the Moonglows, and the Dell Vikings. Although their time together was brief, the Blenders laid the foundation for Beverly's future musical endeavors. Following the dissolution of the Blenders, Beverly created the Butlers in 1963. This group marked his first foray into recording, and in 1967, they released If That's What You Wanted, a northern soul classic that caught the attention of renowned producer Kenny Gamble. Despite their musical talents, the Butlers struggled to find a place within the Philly sound and eventually relocated to San Francisco. There, they rebranded themselves as Raw Soul and caught the attention of Marvin Gaye's sister-in-law. Gay, recognizing their potential, invited them to open for his shows and encouraged Beverly to change the band's name to Mays. Mays's popularity soared in the UK, thanks to the support of DJs Greg Edwards and Robbie Vincent. Their live performances at London's Lyceum Ballroom broadcasted on Capital Radio, introduced them to a wider audience and solidified their status as a beloved soul and funk act. In 2019, Beverly's hit single with Maze, Before I Let Go, received a remarkable cover by Beyonce. This recognition marked a significant milestone in Beverly's career, and he expressed his immense gratitude for the opportunity. From his early days as a gospel singer in Philadelphia to his global success with Maze, Frankie Beverly's musical journey has been marked by talent, perseverance, and a deep love for music. His contributions to the soul and funk genres have left an enduring legacy that continues to inspire and captivate audiences worldwide. Cause of death. A shroud of mystery hangs over the passing of Frankie. The news of his death, delivered by his family on a somber Wednesday, did not explain his sudden absence. Despite living a life seemingly untouched by illness, Frankie's final chapter remains unwritten. Just this year, he confidently assured BlackDoctor.org of his good health, brushing off any concerns about throat issues. No cancer or anything like that, he declared, leaving everyone to wonder what unforeseen circumstance could have stolen him away. Rest in peace, Frankie. The world will surely miss you. Thank you for watching. Share with your family and friends. In the comments section, tell us about your most cherished memories of Frankie. Subscribe and click on the bell notification for more content like this.